central air system, what you should know before buying. Lennox is one of the most popular brands for central heating and air conditioning. In this video, we will go over the air conditioning offerings by Lennox. The goal of this video is to demystify the products available so that you as a homeowner can make a better decision. Let's get started. So to get started here, I'm at the Lennox website. We'll start by going to the homeowner solution. One thing that you will find out about Lennox is that they have a lot of products, 12 air conditioners to be precise. So there's a lot of choices here. And your question as a buyer is, what's the best product for me? And how do I make a, an informed decision? The first thing we're going to do is break down the three product lines of Linux. So Linux organizes their products into three different categories. You have the marriage series, which is the entry level series. You have the elite series, which is the mid tier product. And in the very high tier, it's going to be the Linux signature, which is going to be the most expensive products. So they have a standard, better, and best products. The married line is the most affordable product line. They are assembled in Mexico. So the prices of labor and the prices of the merit line is generally more affordable. And it's really designed to be an economical choice for air conditioning. The elite line, which is one of the best selling series is uh, a mid-tier line. It, it combines affordability economy with features. So generally most of our customers would buy products from the elite series. And finally, we have the signature line. This is what we would consider the Rolls Royce of air conditioning. So Lennox makes some of the best air conditioning products for residential customers. Um, and the best products that they have in each category can be found in the signature line. So with Lennox, they produce all of their products that are elite and signature in the United States. And the Marriott line is made in Mexico, which would lower the cost. The very first model we're going to look at is going to be the 13 ACX air conditioner. When you look at an air conditioning system, you're really concerned about a few things. The first one is the stage of operation. In this case, this product is a single stage air conditioner. The second thing you're concerned about is the SEER rating. The SEER rating is the energy efficiency rating of your system. So it's very similar to how when you buy a car, you look at the miles per gallon, MPG, uh, which denotes how much energy you're going to be using per mile. The SEER rating is the same thing, uh, but for electricity and how the units work. In California, the minimum SEER rating is actually 14. So this product cannot be installed in California. This can be installed in other states that have lower efficiency rating requirements. But in California, a minimum of 14 is required for uh, an air conditioner. And this system is a single stage system. So single stage system has one motor in the compressor. So what it does is it turns on full power, reaches your temperature, and it turns off uh, once you reach your temperature. The problem with the single stage is that it's gonna be quite noisy because you're gonna hear it on and off and a clicking noise every time it turns on and off. However, it is the most reliable and the least expensive in terms of air conditioning uh, technology. So it's gonna be what you found in your, you find in your standard system. So the next part we're gonna look at is gonna be the ML14 XC1. As we can see here, similar to the previous model, this one is a single stage air conditioner. And it says here, the SEER rating can be up to 17. So the SEER rating really depends on how you can install the product. So this is rated at between 14 and 17 SEER, depending on how the installers actually install the product. So from here, we're gonna to go to the 16 ACX air conditioner. And this one is similar to the, the 14, and that, and that is, it's up to 17 SEER. However, what we're gonna find here is that this is a uh, two-stage system. So here it says multi, stage air conditioner. That means it has two stages. So the difference between a single stage and a two stage is that when you turn on a single stage system, it either goes on or off. With a two stage, imagine, imagine having two engines inside of the compressor. So when you first turn on the power, it goes on full power. And then when it reaches the temperature, it's gonna uh, turn off half of its power. It's gonna coast. So this means that you're having a much more quiet system and a much more efficient system. So typically uh, for most of our customers, we either go with a, uh, a high sear single stage 
or a two-stage system. And the two-stage is, is one of the most common offerings that we, that we offer. So the 16 ACX is the most affordable two-stage system that Linux makes. So we've completed the Merit series. So the Merit series really has three products, the 13 seer product, the 14 to 17 seer single stage product, and a 16 seer two stage products. This is, this is the entry level products for Linux. And this is a good starting point if you're on a budget. So now we're gonna to move to the elite line. The elite line is their most uh, popular products and it's the most uh, common products that we sell to customers. So we're gonna start with the 16XC1 because the 16XC1 and the XC16 are very similar in functionality, except that the 16 is a higher seer product. So you can see here, this is a single stage system, but it's a higher efficiency single stage than the Maris uh, series. And one of the main differences between the EL, which is the Elite series and the Maris series is that within the Elite series, they have a tier shaped design for the condenser. And they also have better jackets inside of the compressor. So the sound that you hear outside is much lower on the Elite series and the Maris series. The mirror series is just a bare bone system that does not have much insulation. So you're gonna hear the full noise. Within the compressor of the EL16, they have a jacket which uh, blocks many of the sound noises from the compressor itself. So the next product we're gonna look at is the EL18XCV. This is a newer product by Linux and it's an 18 seer system. The difference between this system and the 16 seer system that you saw before is this one is truly variable. Truly variable means that it has many motors inside of the compressor. So we think about the offering of air conditioning. The most important thing you care about is gonna be the, the stages of operation. So a single stage system turns on full power, it gets its temperature, it turns off. When it gets hotter, it turns back on. So there's about a five, four to five degrees difference in temperature of what you're setting the thermostat on. So there's, there's a delta of four to five degrees. With a two-stage system, you turn on full power, it reaches the temperature, it turns off half, it's coasting. So it's going to be between two and three degrees of what you're setting. So you're getting very, very good, precise temperature with a two-stage and, and lower noise level. With variable, imagine having 100 different motors inside of the compressor. So you want 10%, you get 10%. You want 11%, you get 11%. If you need 17%, it'll give you 17%. And the benefit of this is that you're able to precisely get your temperature within one degree and the noise level is much lower because only the part of the system that needs to be on is on at any given time. So the EL18 is the first truly variable system that Linux offers for the elite line. The next product we're gonna look at is gonna be the XC16. And this product has been on the market for a while. And this is one of the very popular products from Linux. So this is a two-stage system that's up to 17 SEER. So this is a very uh, popular product for most Linux customers. They also have the XC20, and this is very similar to the 18 SEER model. It's, it's truly variable and it's a high efficiency. So it's, um, if you want a, the highest SEER model that's variable for the Elite series, this is a product for you. So let's recap the Linux Elite series. We have the XC13. This is limited and regional because it depends on, on the region that you're in. This may or may not be viable. In California, we don't, we don't sell this because we have a minimum of 14 SEER. The Elite series is uh, the single stage model. It's going to be the EL16 XC1. This is actually one of the most popular selling models of Linux. And this is what we generally recommend our, our customers because it has a good balance between cost feature and sound level because the mirror series, as we mentioned before, doesn't have sound insulation on the condenser. So it's quite loud on the outside. This one has a good balance of features and efficiency. The EL18XCV is the first truly variable condenser that Linux makes. The difference between this product and the XC20 is the XC20 is slightly more energy efficient. So it's gonna be slightly more expensive. For customers that are one variable, I would say that both would work very well for you. 
there isn't that much of a difference between 18 and 20 seer. So whatever is within your budget, I think you should you can go for it. The XC16 is the two-stage offering of Linux. So unlike the EL16 XC1, which is single stage, this one is a two-stage air conditioning system. In my opinion, I would much rather have a two-stage system uh, with lower efficiency than a high SEER single-stage system. So now we're gonna move on to the Linux signature series. So these are the Rolls Royce of Linux. It's gonna be the most expensive product on the market. Um, Linux is typically on the upper tier and you can often find products from Linux offering at Costco or Home Depot, uh, as well as from other retailers like ours. So the first product on the signature line is gonna be the SL18XC1. So here's what Linux has to say about this product. It's a single stage air conditioner, it is the quietest and most efficient single stage air conditioner you can buy. So the thing about Linux is that they like to innovate in a residential space. So they typically have the best products in every category. So SL18XC1 is the highest efficiency for a single stage system. In practicality, it really doesn't make sense to buy this product because it's much more expensive than the two stage elite system and it's only single stage. So for practica practical purposes, I would much rather get a XC16, which is two stage, rather than SL18XC1, even if they're the same price. You're getting two stage versus single stage. And usually the SL18XC1 is priced very similar to the XC20. So in that case, I would much rather get the, the variable stage elite series than a, than a single stage signature series. But Linux likes to create the best product in every category. And this is why the SL18 XC1 exists, even though commercially, it's not, it's not the option that I would go for. So now the next product that we're gonna look at is the XC21. So this is the Linux signature product. This is the most efficient two-stage central air conditioning system you can buy. It's up to 21 SEER, and it's the most efficient two-stage available. Uh, a, a great product, and it's quite big because as you get more energy efficient, these condensers get really big. So you do need to take in account of the size of the unit. Now we're gonna look at the XC25. So the XC25 is a variable air conditioner. It's the most precise and efficient air conditioner you can buy. So before last year, this is actually the top of the line product on the market at 26 SEER, which is crazy. Because you think about it, the average air conditioning system that is installed new is between 14 and 16 SEER today. And if you look at the past, it used to be as low as 10 SEER. So the this is really a highly efficient system. It's very quiet. However, it's gonna be very expensive. If you're looking at like an XC25 system in California, you're looking maybe like 18 to $20,000 for a complete system. So it's really not the cost effective for most people. And the high SEER rating is really not something you need because you're spending a lot more money on the, the system that you're not gonna get back from just energy efficiency. However, this is the, one of the best products on the market. If you have a taste for Rolls Royce and Bentley, then this is the product for you. Starting in 2021, Linux actually has improved upon their previous innovation and released the SL28XCV. This is the most expensive and precise air conditioning system you can buy. So at 28 SEER, uh, with all the technology, this is the top of the line. There is currently no better product in terms of energy efficiency, sound level, than this one. So this is gonna be the most expensive. This is the best product on the market. If you want the best product, this is the one for you. So let's recap on the Linux signature line. Linux likes to make the best central air products for every category. So the SL18XC1 is the best for the single stage. The XC21 is the best for the two stage. 
and the SL28 XCV is the best product for the variable speed. Prior to the SL28, the XC25 was their best product. So today, the XC25 is a very good product, but the best product is going to be the SL28 XCV. Now, the question is, what product should you go with? Because we have a lot of products here and various different price points. I think that it, what you want to do is first start with your budget, figure out what you want to get out of your air conditioning. Do you want a single stage system? Do you want a two stage system? And also when you're buying a product for air conditioning, the most important consideration is going to be single stage, two stage or variable. The second consideration is going to be seal rating. And the third consideration you should look at is going to be the sound level. So all these units have a decibel sound level that uh, that's rated at. So you can actually look up the specs of every unit and it tells you what noise level it has. So for example, let's go into one of the products to see the sound level. So for example, let's look at this brochure, which has the sound efficiency of each system. So you can see that the XC20 is as low as 65 decibel, while the XC13 is as low as 74 decibel. So you can see that there's a clear difference in the sound level as you move up in, ter in, in terms of product. And so it can range from 74 to 65. So let's look at the merit line as a comparison. So you can see the merit line, the decibel sound is going to be somewhere between the 75, 76 range. The elite line, you see that it goes all the way as low as 65 to 70. So it's much lower. So here you're going to see the sound rating for the signature line. You can see that it starts off as low as 69, but it goes all the way to 56, 59, which is very, very low. Because remember, sound rating is based on a log scale. So when it's 10, when it's 10 decibel lower, it's actually 10 times lower uh, because it's a log scale. So you, as you look at here, you can see the key things that you consider for buying an air conditioner. The first one is energy efficiency. The CO rating would tell you how, much, how efficient it is. You also care about the stage of cooling, whether single stage, two stage, or variable. And then the decibel, how much, uh, how low is your decibel system right here? So in summary, Lennox is one of the most recognized brands for central seating air conditioning in the United States. If you go to Costco or Home Depot, you will see them represent Lennox systems. This is a solid HVAC system, and it's typically on the higher end in terms of cost relative to the rest of the market. We will do a video about all the other brands, and that way you can compare between Lennox, Carrier, Train, Daikin, Goodman. Uh, that, that's coming out later. One of the reasons why Lennox is so expensive is that they have the best products for the residential air conditioning systems. They have a very well-trained dealer network, and they're very highly selective about who gets to be a Lennox Premier dealer. The number of people with access to the signature line is limited to ensure quality of technician as well as exclusivity. If you're in the market for a Lennox system and you live in California, please consider working with us. The air conditioning company has been working with Lennox for nearly a decade, and we offer high quality installations at reasonable prices. We have retail locations in both Southern California and Northern California. Our SoCal office is located in Orange County, and we service San Diego, Orange County, and Los Angeles. Our NorCal office is located in San Jose, and we service the SF Bay Area and Sacramento. If you have any questions, please give us a call or send us an email. Our team is happy to answer any and all questions that you have about air conditioning. You can get a free estimate by using the form below.